Workers can now sue their employer if they're fired for having a gun in their personal car. Governor Bill Haslam signed this bill into law this week. News Channel 9's Betsy Golden joins us now with more. Betsy? Well, Calvin, in 2013, a law was passed in Tennessee that would allow employers to keep their guns in their car despite their boss's wishes. Now, some say this change clears up that law, but many say it just makes it muddy. The Shooters Depot in Chattanooga teaches people all day long about gun safety and laws. But even the owner of the company, John Martin, isn't in support of the bill Governor Haslam just signed. It's affecting every retail and manufacturing business in the state of Tennessee, large and small, independent and corporate. It is affecting anyone that employs an individual. It allows workers to sue their employers if they're fired for having a gun in the car. I think it's as clear as mud. The state basically is denying a business the right to control their property. However, I know that the state reinforces that right for a civilian. Well, if I was a property owner, I feel that if you were to come on my property with a firearm and I didn't want you there, then um, I, have, I should have the right to be able to refuse you on my property. He believes it should be the same with businesses. However, others believe a permit carrying gun owner should be able to keep their gun in their car no matter what. Because of the Castle Doctrine, people can protect themselves in their homes and cars in Tennessee, even if that means using deadly force. Now, an attorney general did find that employers can still terminate someone for not following the company's policy on guns. Calvin. Okay, thanks, Betsy.